Hello everybody. So I'm back. Forest month is here. And now with the zero tolerance O100, I think is also knife which uh, people which like knife knives uh, knows. And uh, unfortunately, this knife is discontinued. And I don't know. I think they may not produce it again. I don't know the reason for my eyes. It is great. Maybe some license of with the Ken Onion which was designer of the knife I don't know but the knife was was and is in my in my hand is it is great uh, one from the thing when I when I saw it first time on, uh, on YouTube I said that, that's great knife I like recurved plate you know some guys said why why you like recurved you know it's hard to sharpen it and so uh, why you buy this one and uh, I said yeah especially this, this is a these are nice people I don't understand because um, for me the recurve is like cheating you know the shorter blade can do can do work what what longer blade can the, of, of course some minus there is the sharpening depend how how small the, the curvature on the, on the blade is if it's just it's just small one or long long blade especially so if you see the Armageddon's, for example, tops Armageddon, so there is there is a recurve blade, but it's not that that much recurved. So I think there for the small plate of of stone, it's not that really big deal to sharpen it. On this knife, on zero tolerance, one that yes, it is. So you need to use rounded, sharpened stone or, or diamonds or whatever these things you're using for sharpening. So this is this is uh, this is it. So this is complete knife. If we are talking about uh, about uh, complete package, you know, you got a knife, you got your sheet, you don't need anything else, you don't need to put any money to it. Well, this is one from the biggest or be the, the best one in my eyes. Someone said that this is nylon sheet and blah blah blah. Well, find me today which company is making that good tactical sheet, you know. We go to SC, everybody knows SC sheet. I think they are great, but there, you know, there's not so many of them. So, this is one from the great one. And um, as I said, one, one thing which I seen on, on YouTube, which, uh, which you know, like kicked me to, to the knife, said, Yes, you like it, you like the shape, then buy it, was the video where, where some guy tried to simply destroy the knife. He used it for Plenty of things, you know, you cut the wire. Of course, from the easy task, wood and then ropes and then then nails and then then some copper tubes and whatever. And then in the end, they, they cut some some bricks or whatever. I I, I I couldn't find a video now. Maybe it's there. I think I downloaded it before, but I don't know where it's in my collection somewhere. So uh, the, the guy in the end really destroyed the knife. You know how. He just smashed, hammered this one into a piece of wood about that deep and then he, he hammered from the side and then he broke the knife I think it was somewhere here you know somewhere here because there's not a big part and so so I think the most of knife which you use in this way you will simply destroy I think the test was to the, the meaning was really I want the knife to destroy I don't care but I want to see when, you know, and it is bloody hell tough steel, tough knife. So I said, well, yes, it is good choice. Let's go for it. So we got 328 grams of this knife. So it is a little bit heavier, just, just a bit heavier than the Silent Hero, but it is, it is short, shorter especially on the blade we'll talk about a little bit later so 328 grams 11.6 ounces 11.6 ounces uh, the sheet of course I think that that silent hero was 103 grams this is 199 grams so nearly twice as heavy but you got plenty options uh, all together all together we got 525 grams so we are over one one ounce one one pound, uh, sorry, one pound, two point six uh, uh, ounces. So we are over one one pound. Sorry, one pound, one pound, two point six ounces. 
all together. So this is about 100 grams for about four ounces more than the whole package of Silent Hero. Why I why I'm doing I'm talking about it about it. I will do it a little bit later in the later video. But for me, the meaning of these knives are pretty similar. This is not made for African, but it is you know all purpose and also combat knife knife this one and tops silent here also so that's why i'm i'm trying to com compare it with that so uh thickness is 4.8 millimeters that was 4.7 i really tried it to digital the measure equipment I, I don't know how you say it in english i, I really tried to catch it on a couple of places on the of, of the blade if the measuring is wrong somewhere you know so i try a couple of things a couple of places on the silent hero on this uh, zero tolerance uh, also no it's really 4.8 so it is, it is 0.1 millimeter so it's just hair thicker than that knife is uh, the coating if i thought if i think if i'm thinking about if it's by the coating to be honest i don't think so the coating it doesn't look like like that it's a dlc it's a tungsten dlc coating so it's more more sturdy as you can see the knife is not new one uh, you can buy a new one at the moment <clears throat> so i don't know just it is hard to say how they make it from just just that hair thicker but it is simply it is okay we got to we are going to the point now <clears throat> A length of blade is 13 centimeters, measured it from the same place as a silent hero. So from here, from the very end of the handle, not from somewhere here, but from the very end of the handle. So we got 13 centimeters here. 13 guys, which is 5.2 inches about. So that's really nothing. It's short knife against silent hero. That, one, that, that short. You know, that's that's you know in say in combat and you know in reach. Three centimeters can be really something, you know, in, in this size, of course, we are talking about size. And we got a handle of, um, length of handle is, that was really interesting for me because, of course, I'm, I'm counting the handle from here to the end and it is 13.5 centimeters. So more than, than, than the blade is, Wait, we've got 5.5 inches 5.2 blade 5.5 uh, the handle so you know it's, it's a little bit funny the handle is longer than the blade but it is simply like that but you know it depends from from the measurement how it this knife is really the holding is made for i think for trusting so you can you can use it in this way of course but for trusting for piercing you know this is the holding is this is more fighting knife so it's silent hero is a little bit more all-purpose knife this is more fighting knife but it's still the shape can do plenty of things let's go let's go uh, to the next point we got the g10 handles no liners you see that shaping great Uh, CPN 3B, that's important. I think you can read it here. CPN 3B. And it is hardened to 50, 58 to 60. So it's two, 2 degrees up. So harder than the Silent Hero is. Well, yeah, so this is this guy is hard to sharp, really. It's hard to sharp, especially with the recurve. Uh, if I will talk about the, about the basic basic production uh, there was a little bit disappointing a couple of people men mentioned it somewhere on, on some some discussions you see I, I a little bit did it for myself I can say like that see the see the hole here so I did it like a little bit feeling changed where where the the choil, I call it choil. It wasn't meant probably by that, but I call it choil. So I want to to have to, to have a space between the choil and the blade itself. Uh, the problem on this knife was only, as you can see, the part here. 
I think it was in that high it was dual it was really really dual like it was machined like this one and then stick it in the, into the real edge and it was somewhere here so I, I, I think I did about five millimeters of the edge definitely I, I, I added like it was dual simply dual not 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 like not sharp on touch it was dual you can you can see the, the flat part norm, normal flat part not 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 like like dual dual edge flat part so I did reprofiling with this one well, with my hand uh, diamond sharpness it was bloody hell I, I said in another videos I didn't have any machine before so this this one was only way how I I can do it and it was it was hard job I I, I destroyed a couple of them simply just just use, use it and you know file file use the filing motions and uh, yeah so I did now I got the I got the <laughs> I got the work work how is it work sharpener Ken Onion edition so interesting because it's Ken Onion yeah? uh, so Yes, I, I used it for now for it. I destroyed a couple of these belts there, but now it is sharp. I'm not say sharp as hell because the angle, the angle here, as you can see, because th this part is short, the angle here is more, you know, small than this one is. This is more long, so this is more slicer than this one is. But I always wanted it because. I said if I want to to break some some wire again wire we spoke about uh, Kangi Pihot, hop uh, about wire this one the edge is not that easy it's not not the angle is not that big it's smaller so when if I try to cut through the the wire I hope it will not destroy the edge or damage the edge destroy probably not but damage the edge you know you know what I, what I mean so it will be a little bit that one and it is slicing wood anyway but, but not not in that not in that way like here another thing about this knife yeah so that was only only disappointing me nothing else on this knife is dis disappointing me only, only this one I don't know why they did it. simply if they will start someone say okay if, if they will start the, the blade here when the shape you know, where, where the shape is going to the to the like this part to, to the top here from from this side if the edge will be, will be complete here to this place that will be absolutely great but there will be no choil of course and with the choil now I can hold it comfortable and I can use it like like bush cut this short blade so then I can do this is 13 centimeters so I, I got about really five inches here I mean real edge is about five inches here about so I can hold it, and it's more, it's more, it is more, more uh, like you know, balanced knife for for everything. See the point of balance is somewhere here. So yeah, it's exactly in the choil here. So where you hold it, so the knife is really fast. And what was very interesting, you know, with my uh, cold steel, cold steel Senmai Tanto, I tried to cut some, some. Uh, paper box or something like that and uh, it, it is 12 inches blade semi steel sharp so I tried to you know slice it through and the tanto couldn't so I said well, I was a little pissed off I said why so it's long you know samurai sword you know you know so I used this one wow it was sliced like like nothing I, I really was surprised how easy this the curvature is working it slice slice like hell this is really fighting knife guys for, for slicing and trusting I think the best knife ever I've seen as a fighting knife of course you can have some diggers well, I'm, I'm now um, like interested in in a cold steel new Taipan CPN 3B Taipan I like uh, that diggers for as especially for fighting for some you know some martial arts stuff the diggers are, uh, could be good to be using using them in our system but what the point is uh, what the point is uh, anyway the shape of the handle is here much better the one is simply straight you know digger straight straight handle but this is more more like saber saber holding and you really can do your swings your stops pretty much secure and fast 
you know, you, you could reach that. So that's, uh, this is this is really good. Let's do something. Oh, sorry, I forget more something about the sheet. So I said this is one from the best. You got a Velcro here. You don't need to to put your belt off your pants. You just open this one and stick it there. You are tired. You go for somewhere. You need to take off your knife and don't want to have some problems or s spending time to put your knife back. Well, easy. You take it. this one is staying on your pants. Nothing problem. I think nobody care about it in nature. You you go there, just stick it. Then you got a strap here. You can put it. You know this is some mole compatible system. You can put it somewhere on your vest, tactical vest, or or your bag, whatever. And uh, you can put put this strap to your leg here, here, or here. I I used it here. I don't know if you can if you will see it. And it, it, it was it was too low. It was too low. Now I've got it somewhere here. And when when it was too low, the the knife was a little bit like D shape in this way in this way. So I changed that. I just put it here. Now it is all right. So it is excellent. There is a Kydex insert shaped like that, which is holded by the screw here many companies is doing here I think this uh, this company is did, did, did it first time I never seen it before but now you can see the couple of couple of guys I think uh, uh, hook 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 knives do it and they say oh look we got this one this is great yes of course but they are not you know you know why I'm, I, I talk I spoke about it before some sometimes I think and it looks to me that, that some companies try to promote it. Look what we in, invented. But it is not right. Most of the time they, they didn't invent it. Yeah, they use it. It's great. It's a great idea. Nothing else. But sometimes they are like moving into that. We, we invent it. Maybe I'm wrong. So I, I feel it like this way. Maybe I'm wrong. I'm sorry about that. But simply, I, I've seen it first time here. It is great. I, I actually using this 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 uh, this sheet for another knife for my SOG uh, knife also just I just put this one open this one there is the screw so I'll take all these in there with the knife out and put another knife there so because this kydex here is holding the knife I really don't need to use that that where it is I, <laughs> you can see I, I I'm not using it. Here it is, there is a velcro. So there is the there is the there is the, the another strap which you can you can turn here, turn it out. It will it will fix the, the blade here, so if if the knife will move here, because the, here is the wider part, it will stop. It will stop. But I never use that because this is this is I, I, I'll pull it a little more. This is much more, you know, this is secure, you put it in your hand. If I will have it here, of course, without these straps, if I will have it here, say, okay, then I will think about maybe, but, but on the leg, I never use that, never lose it. You can see how, how, how it is there, how it is there. So it's great. So another thing is pocket. They said it is for your uh, zero tolerance folder O200, which is same blade, blade shape and the design basically is the same. Only there is 154 cm still. I bought it before three months about, and I love the uh, love the folder. And what you can put, uh, you can put your your sharpening stone or whatever. Multi tool. So you put more title there if you need it. If you don't have it, where to put it? You know, you can have some compass sharpening stone, you know, sharpening system. So this is, uh, this could be like kind of survival knife also, just because of, just because of these improvements of the sheet. You know, so for what the sheet is a little bit dirty. You know, this is really not new. I got the the knife a couple of years, so it's, it's a really great knife. 
So the sheath is really one from the, the greatest I've ever seen on the knives. I and I bought a couple of knives and simply uh, I don't know. So this is this is great sheath. Sharpness, I don't know, to be honest. So this is the part which didn't exist before. See that? So, so this slicing. Well, sharp enough for work. Let's do something. Batoning. This is more, more thicker. Place um, more thicker piece of, of wood, same than more than was Silent Hero. Similar? No. So, even with that, with the knots here, 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 so here, knife can perform this. So, I wasn't that worried. Even the the piece of wood was was uh, harder to to split than the that uh, than that silent hero did. I wasn't that worried about the knife. I simply trusted more because I seen what it can stand and CPM 3V is CPM 3V in same thickness we got out here it came it came around just another thing See how how it is how how it is holding. See how it is separating. Well, so. I will, I'm trusting more to this knife than to Silent Hero because simply it looks for me, uh, you know, it's the steel and everything what can stand more. Interesting is I didn't tell you there is, you know, like kind of to way to false edge, but just not really. So there is just small part in full in, in full wideness here. Uh, so this is. Uh, I can think about it like you know, wow, the knife can be weaker here, but it is not. It is really, really great. So that was the batoning. It did well. The limbing. The limbing, small, small sapling. I will hold it here. So 
easy. Easy way. Some chopping small parts. Holding here. Of course there is the hook here, but I don't use slushing, so I must hold it here, like, like this, in this way, for the swing. I, I can go here without lashing, or I can, but it is not that secure. So, I will use it here, and I go to swing motion. I like to say that the knife is shorter than Silent Hero was, and, uh, and this one is thicker, a little bit thicker than that one. So, so compared compared to Silent Hero, this is this this one can perform. Uh, wait a moment. Silent Hero. So not, didn't go through. Also, so. And if, if we are talking about reach. So this is this is really. If, if I'm chopping the Silent Hero with this, you can see the reach different. So that was the chopping of these small parts. Uh, let's have a look and let's have a look for this for some you know uh, tip making. Of course I can slice it or I can simply use the shape so basic design this is this is the improvement So it is there. A notch. The edge is not not that fine as on Silent Hero, because the angle. And everything must be processed by the belly here. Or there is a like kind of flat part on the tip, so I can use it to finish the task this way. But anyway, we got the, we got the, we got the thing done. So this is it. Uh, chopping, chopping. Moment. Chopping with the knife, with the hardwood. I need to really use use the belly. That's that's only thing I can do through this hard wood, as you hear. And as I said, I, I'm holding the knife here, and I'm pretty much secure. To be honest, the knife will not move. Is not moving back. You know, it, it didn't back forward. D didn't try to fall fall from my hand to go out. Really, it's just holding. I don't know why. But it is simply working this way, so I can do pretty much strong swing. So this is really hard wood, this is not something, you know, this is not spruce, you know, so...
So what we what we uh, seen here on the zero tolerance O100 is it, this is great knife and it is a shame that that zero tolerance is finished the producing of these. I don't know why uh, I didn't see uh, there's new fixed knives. If they don't have that ma that many of them again, uh, but uh, this one was the best from me. I I, I thought about theirs. Uh, I think it was point one one hundred, one hundred eighty, uh, small one, small one, four inches by I think. But uh, you know the advertising from that wasn't that good. Wasn't performed as I've expected compared to the price. That one was. Uh, is now more more expensive th than this knife was and it, because it's shorter from some I don't know what the four extra vanadi steel if I can remember it I don't know I'm not sure with the sheet which wasn't bad but this one serves me be better you know zero tolerance if if you you trying to do some some fixed blade use CPN 3D you know how to use it and do do some some great stuff as it before I think that all the other knives uh, fixed blades are not that that good in my eyes in my eyes great knife great great options if you if you looking for a knife which is kind of tactical kind of uh, you know hard to use knife uh, I can say survival five inches blade should be enough it is strong enough to stay something to stand something have a look for the tip this is really really thick tip against the, you know silent hero we compare it silent hero so this is this is really really great only disadvantage for buying say was this one this one in my eyes unfinished part of this of the of the blade and um, the problem which is with the recurved blades is hard to sharpen it uh, how to sharpen especially this this part so this part here you are fine but here wow this is this is hell because you can't put you can put even even the small flat stones they are still there's still a little bit like u shape which you don't you can't sharpen so this one is sharp still pretty much sharp after batonic chopping so great knife my recommendation is yes compared to the to the tops silent hero well <laughs> hard to say hard to say which will be little little comparing to the to the uh, this knife silent hero and my old SOG it will be short video but uh, you see see you after a few minutes